Hi, it's Michael Lafito, author of the book Luxury Listing Specialist and founder of the Luxury Listing Specialist Certification for Agents and Broker Owners. In this week's video, we're going to talk about owner financing when marketing your high-end and luxury properties and how by doing so, by offering owner financing, you'll open up uh, your pool of buyers to a larger pool and a lot more international buyers and we'll talk to you about that in this video. But before we do this, if you haven't done so, subscribe to our channel, our YouTube channel, Marketing Luxury Group. And if you haven't done so, check out our podcast, Luxury Listing Specialist on iTunes, and make sure you like it. We, we are about to release our 70th episode as we're about to release this, and we have some exciting things that we're going to be announcing later in this video. So first off, let's get back to owner financing. Owner financing, um, on that podcast I referenced, uh, our podcast called Luxury Listing Specialist. On our 12th episode, going back almost two years ago, we had a guy, a gentleman on, Frank Azami. He's with Sotheby's. He's out of, the, out of Arizona. And Frank talked about owner financing on our 12th podcast. So check it out. I highly recommend you listen to it. It's about a 30-minute episode. But when I used to think about owner financing, I thought, why would you offer owner financing? You're going to get lower non-qualified buyers that perhaps have bad credit or whatever. I, I, I was thinking those things, but Frank opened my eyes to a totally different uh, reason to open uh, owner financing up to a larger pool of buyers. You see, internationally, there's a lot of tax burdens and there's a lot of push back on a lot of these high net worth individuals in some of these in China and in, in, in some of these other countries and so by offering owner financing you will get qualified buyers that have tons of money tied up in their markets or in, in various assets that they just will be taxed too much to bring it all out to buy some of these multi-million dollar properties so they're well qualified but there's just too many tax ramifications for them to pull out the money all at once. So, for example, educate yourself. There's a lot of great free reports up there, out there. NAR put this report, Pro Profile of International Transactions. And for example, the top five foreign buyers um, last year, number one was China, $13.4 billion in real estate they purchased in Illinois. So it's not in Illinois, in the United States. Uh, China was number one. Number two was Canada, number three was India, number four was United Kingdom, and number five was Mexico. So know where the international buyers are coming from, but number one, China, there's a lot of downward pressure there, and the number of international transactions and purchases has actually gone down this year over the previous year because of the, the reasons I just mentioned. So again, check out episode 12 with Frank Azami. And if you have any questions about um, anything that when it comes to previous episodes or real estate, you want us to talk about something, my contact information is below. But as I was mentioning, thinking outside the box and being creative, it's really necessary, especially with those high-end and luxury properties, because in most markets, it's what we call a buyer's market. There's a lot of inventory. There's stale listings, you're not getting showings, the feedback is negative. So you have to be creative and owner financing is one of the ways you can do it. Sure, you're gonna get unqualified buyers, you're gonna get tire kickers, you're gonna get falsified letters, you're gonna get this, that, and the other thing. So you have to do your due diligence, but it only takes one qualified buyer from China or some within the United States or somewhere else by offering owner financing, it only takes one. So. Talk to your broker owner, talk to an attorney, have your client talk to an attorney or title company before making any decision. But it's our job as mar marketing agents to present options and let them choose what's best for them. Last but not least, check out our swag. We just got some new hats in. Go to LuxurySpecialsGear.com. We got some really cool hats white with gold, we got pink for the ladies, we got navy blue and gold, and of course we got some amazing shirts on Luxury Specials gear. This is one of my favorites, I'm very patriotic. This is the American Luxury shirt, and our, <clears throat> our main shirt is just our simple Luxury Specialist shirt. We have others, we have different colors, blues, grays, whites. Go to LuxurySpecialsGear.com, and if you have any questions, let me know. My name is Michael Lafito. Continue to raise the bar and work smarter, not harder, and prove others wrong. Take care.